Good morning, my name is Andy Georgiades of Nicholas Petersco, firm of Charlotte Accountants. A capital gains on acquisition of a second property. If you have recently acquired a second property, you are in a position where you can elect which is your main residence. By electing your main residence, you can actually mitigate your capital gains tax liability on a second property. The time limits are that you have to have had the property within the last two years. As soon as you've acquired that second property, the clock starts ticking for you to elect which is your main residence. The criteria is that you've got to frequently visit that property. You frequently have to go and spend some time there. If that's the case, you can elect that as your main residence, even only for a month, and then afterwards change your main residence back to what the original residence was. This will actually mean that the period while the property was your main residence is exempt from capital gains, and three years after that property has changed and is no longer your main residence, you would still be subject to exemption from capital gains tax. So we are looking at people that have got these second properties, frequently visit them, make sure you make the election and you have two years within the time of acquiring it to make that election.